Well, I chose to study Western dress partly because of my Montana roots. Within the exhibit, you'll see a picture of me with my granddad, who was a Montana rancher, and my cowboy boots that I wore while I was a student in Montana State. When I was in about the eighth grade, it was real important to me to look like a cowgirl. So I had this pair of Western girl jeans and a Western cut blouse to wear with my Acme boots. This is my favorite image in the exhibit because this is where my research began. Working cowboys wore dress pants that were slightly worn out, dress shirts without the starched collar, and galluses, which is what cowboys call their suspenders. In addition, on this platform, you'll see a pair of youth chaps that some ranchers bought their sons to indicate that those sons were ready to begin their work as men on the working ranch. Western dress has come a long way from its functional roots to something that is truly flamboyant. For example, these shafts wouldn't be very functional on the range. If the wind flipped those bat wings, the horse would probably dump its rider in the ditch. I hope you'll come to the Buffalo Bill Historical Center to see Dress Just Right, which traces the evolution of Western style from function to flamboyance.